NT URL for HTTP request on Tamox Android. One other thing that you may want to do is to write the output of your curl command to a file. So let me clear my terminal once more. After clearing my terminal, I'll create a file and I will call it, I'll cre create a directory, mkdir. I'll call it um, HTTP request. Okay. So cd HTTP um, request. Request. Okay, so ls, you can see it's an empty directory. So I can just run that same command once more. Okay, so if I run this command once more, um, what I have to do now, okay, let me just write everything from scratch. So cURL, then I'll pass the O flag. And please, it is small letter O, okay, not capital O. It is case sensitive. I can do something like um, product.json. Okay, product.json. So instead of writing the output of this CURL command to the terminal, standard output, the way you did initially, now it will be writing it to a file. Okay, in the previous command, when I ran ls, you can see that the, the directory is empty. So after running this command, we are expecting to have a product.json file there. So after passing the O flag and you have your file, the next thing you want to do is to just bring the endpoint. Okay, so just bring the endpoint. After bringing the endpoint, I can just pass in slash one just to get the product to the ID of one. Okay, so run it. Okay, you can see it is done getting now ls you can see i have product.json and if i want to cut product.json um, you can check the tamox linux uh, commands essential commands for tamox linux or it's on the youtube channel and the link will be in the description below so i covered all those all the essential commands that you're going to be needing for tamox you can just check it out so cat product.json you can see instead of writing it to the terminal i was able to write it to this particular file okay so that is that is that about that so one other thing that you can do is to make it more presentable more readable there's a way you can pretty print it to the terminal that will make it more um readable okay so i can just do something like this let me clear my terminal then after clearing my terminal um i will have to add the jq library the jq command so pkg pkg install jq okay let me just pass the y flag so I won't have to let's wait for it to install. Let's wait for it to install. Okay, now I have the PKG command the JQ command installed. I can use it to pretty to pretty print the output of that um, request. So I can now do curl C U R L. I'll bring in the endpoints. Then after bringing in the endpoint, I can do slash one just to get so let me do slash three. Then I'll bring in a pipe. Where is the pipe on this keyboard? Okay, this is it. Then I'll pass in JQ. Okay, you will see the way to print this one. You can see what I have now. You can see what I have. So he printed it way better than he did initially. So you can see the ID of three, powder, canister, you can see the description, the category, the price. He displays it better this way using the JQ uh, command that we just installed.